Greetings and welcome back to Factorio. I'm Catherine of Sky, and we were just going to approach the red circuit area so that we can put in a few of the belts that are missing here um, because we definitely need to get this outpost up and running quite soon. Uh, or, well, it would be nice if it was opening quite soon. It does look like we don't have a... Oh, where's my mouse? There we go. Okay. Um, I don't think we actually have a plastic train. Um, hmm. We have plastic happening, which is good, but no train that is actually delivering it currently. Now, these guys are kind of suffering for lack of modules uh, and beacons and basically everything. So this production of plastic is going to be a bit slow, a bit being an understatement there, um, but it will be fine. We will get it. It will be fine. The sulfur train is here. It is doing stuff. We have sulfuric acid a little bit. Not actually very much, do we? Um, lubricant has got, we got plenty of that, which we could have had delivered to our new belt bank, but um, I chose not to for whatever reason. I don't remember why. But um, we have coal being input as well. So we can actually make blue circuits at this point, I believe. And we can set up a thing for that. The only problem, as we have seen, is the severe lack of belts. Oh, and there's a train. Wait, why is this train still out of fuel? Dude. We sent a RoboPort request to put down a chest. Game. Yo. Did we run out of... No, there are 14 blue chests in the system. 14 of them. And it hasn't been placed down yet. Why not? Dude. It's well within the network. I don't get this. God. Alright. I'll go down there. I feel like sometimes this is... It's, there's some very derpy stuff going on here. Uh, within the game itself. It might be because of the mega solar farms we just put down. But eh, I don't know about that. I don't know. I am... Uh, kind of skeptical, I have to say about that. Also, why did this go? This should not have gone. This one also does not need a second signal. Why is this one right there? I don't understand that at all. Dude, we need to fix that. Because, um... The thing is, these guys, the chain signals... It should wait until this is clear before releasing the train. Unless there's a signal underneath where we can't see under the cars somewhere. Um, okay. Can we get some fuel in there, please? Bots. Yo. Okay. Is it working? Probably not. I don't know why it's not getting fuel. Uh, let's just give it some. Let it go on its way. Okay, is there another... S oh, there's that signal. Oh, that's why. That is why. We need to remove that one then in that case. And remove this one maybe. And just put one here, closest we can. So as soon as it crosses, the next train can go. Okay, so we have a thing now. Yay! Wait, why is this one not... Oh, there we go. That's a reason. Okay, that should get fixed by the bots. Hopefully, maybe one day. We'll think about it. So as soon as we get blue circuits done, that means we can do... Oh, where are we not having storage? Oh, here. Oh, sad times. Sad, sad, sad times. Um, all right. That means we need... We, we, have, we have many things going on here, apparently. Unfortunately, we, we do not have the ability to create uh, more storage chests at this time here because I don't think there are any in this network but we can next time we walk around here we can make said uh, networks that wouldn't be too bad so we'll just do a very simple inserter chain here uh, and it will empty over time it is not a problem though we might want to think about uh, let's actually say L we want to do 178 cells. That's probably... No, it's not. That's probably... This is probably the... Uh, 
the, the solar panel grid, yes. Uh, the other one is also quite big. Our first one, is it 55 cells? This looks like it might be it, because there's many, many things in there. We have 99,000 iron ore. That's okay, because we have a thing, but... Just looking at how many wood. 2.3k? Really? That's it? Hmm. I don't actually know which one is my my main base now. We'll have to check. Would be nice if you could name them. You know? I guess we could look from this. Let's see. What was the other one? 55 cells? Members? 1.9k logistics bots. That looks more like our main base. Okay, so there are only... There are only... How much wood? Where is the wood? Oh, it's up here. 2.5k. But that, I think, is getting recycled. I think that's okay. I don't think that's a bad thing at all. Alright. So, now... Now, we have things mostly kind of under control. Let's go up here. Where is our other group guys. Okay, you go over here and try to fix this. Try to fix this base here. Mm -hmm. Now that you have warmed up and gotten some more stuff and things, we can now yeah, do stuff. I guess what we could do, instead of having a second train stop for belts, we could actually have these go into a chest that feeds this. Mm. That would be a thing. But... But this one, I don't know. I think it's a good thing to have anyway. How much do we have here? 356 belts. That's not too bad. I do feel like we're not using all of it. The, uh, well, we should, we should get the beacons in. We should get the beacons in first. Because if we add more of these assemblies, then... Um, then when the beacons come in, it's going to be a tiny problem. So I think we should leave it. Let's just leave it. And then go M for map mode and see how these spider trons are doing. Ooh, boy. <gasps> Ain't that pretty. Ain't that pretty. Okay. Let's get our plastic train now then. I want to set up this plastic train. It's going to be important. Let's set this up here where there's fuel. And this one, obviously, the color is going to be white, which is 255 on all of these. As per your regular RGB colors, I learned that when I was in um, doing web website design. Taught myself how to make websites, and it was cool. Sort of cool, I guess. Sort of cool. It, well, it was good for my business. I, I uh, didn't have to pay someone to do it, but it did take quite a lot of time. But when you have more time than money, that's the way it goes sometimes. All right, rails, fish book, and plastic car. These are only going to be plastic three, four, five, six, and... Dude! Why? Okay. Okay, you want to be that way? Fine. So... Three, four, five, six, and then we need to go again. Rail cars. I wish this opened. Why? How does this not do this? How does this not open to the last book or section used? Why? Six and seven. Okay. Train, you are free to go to wherever we want to go to. We want to go to oil plastic pickup first. Uh, full cargo, please. Or, I think we'll do time pass for now. Uh, and then we're going to go red circuits, plastic drop off to empty cargo. Completely empty. Go. Do your thing. Train. Go, go. Now this also is messed up from... Yep. We don't want two signals. We only want them to, to go where they need to go. Alright. Train moving. Yo. Also, you do not need to put millions of engines on the front of trains. Like, I see these 3-8 trains. Not needed. I mean... I don't know. It's, it's, it's overkill in almost every situation. Almost every situation is overkill. Um, let's see. Let's go down here. Uh, let's see. Let's get these guys also going around and 
fixing some of the output stuff here. Oh, they have belts. This is so nice. They actually have belts! Hooray! I don't know if they're gonna have enough to get even one of these lines done. Oh, looks like they might have had one line done. That's good. That's excellent, actually. Pretty cool. So now we're just waiting for the plastic train to get here. But otherwise, the whole place is looking pretty decent. Um, I do need... So I don't know how this got changed to that. Because, I mean, this, this did work at some point. But we need to fix this combinator to be not iron. Can I, can I click it? Hello? Oh, I can't. Because I'm in the wrong mode. There we go. Iron to copper. Good. And that way, we're going to get some of the iron stuff in here. We need to put in more belts, as you see. And this is not great. Okay. Let's see. I think that should work this way. And then replace that with that. Okay. Everything else is fine. I think those were just random power poles crossing the landscape at one point. But it is looking good. We are getting... Eh? Okay, why? What What happened with this? Is this a 4 to 8 balancer? Let me check the balancer real quick. Something happened here, obviously. I don't know what, what we did there, but we need to fix it. Do 4 to 8. There we go. That should be the same one. I use the same blueprint books pretty much for everything. Yep, that looks correct. Somehow it got repeated by having these extra splitters on the end, so we don't need those. But we can use these guys. Okay, those are interesting. Okay, we need to do a this, and then a this, and a that. Okay, that doesn't work. Ay ay ay. All right, it's fine. So this one does not have a space. If we remove the signal here, is that going to give us enough space? Maybe. There we go. Okay, that's good. So now, though, we need to put in a signal because that one has been deleted. So we got to go here and here. Um, yep, that's fine. Excellent. Okay, so here's our copper train coming back again. Oh, <gasps> here's the magic. Oh, I love this. It's so good. Look at this. This is why I love this train station. Because we're mixing these on the same lines using the kind of similar technique as we do on the smelting furnaces and other playthroughs. Look at how beautiful it is. Ain't it, birdie? And I know it looks scary to, like, put this stuff through a balancer, but right lane remains on the right lane and left goes on the left lane. So it's absolutely perfect. Oh, we have red chips! Woohoo! Oh my god, we actually have red chips. Look at this! Fancy! Excellent! Oh my goodness, we have a little bit of a mistake there. Okay. Very good, very, 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 very good. I love this candy cane or this peppermint kind of look, though. Isn't that cool? That's why I love this station. Why I included it in the, um, in the blueprints. Also, I don't know what this is. What is this? Why is this belt going there? Oh, that's a fuel belt of some kind. Okay. Well, technically, I don't think we actually have any fueling here, so we can actually bring that, bring that with us. Because it's using up our valuable, valuable belts. I don't see any reason for that at all. I think I was doing like zero bots or something. No, I couldn't have been because we had building train. I don't know. I don't know. It was something. Some reason or other. But anyway, we now have stuff and things. So this is again dependent on modules. That is the main uh, thing that's going to hold us back in this outpost. Um, because we clearly have enough material. I love this. Isn't this great? I had so much fun spaghettiing this. You have no idea. Isn't this fabulous? So pretty. I love it. I love it very much. 
Very, very much I love these. And the same thing with these guys. We don't have enough modules here. Um, what? I think... Do we want to have a fueling station here? We could. We could put it on the outside here or something. I think that might be useful, actually. Having, having a fueling station... I'm going to go and collect one from somewhere. Uh... Because this is a this is a major hub of, of of activity here, so I think it might be worth it. Is this a fueling station? Yes, fuel pickup. Okay, uh, this is all that is needed for a fuel station. So we'll put this over here. I just put this on like here somewhere like that. Yeah, there we go. Come on, Q Q. What is going on with this? Why can't I unqueue? That was so weird. Like, the queue wasn't working. It's still not working. Maybe it's my keyboard or something. I don't know what's going on with that. Um, yeah, I can't I can't queue. There it goes. I don't know what's going on with that. Anyway, we'll figure it out later. In later land. Okay, so this is wanting to go there at the nearest. And we can go down here. Now, keep in mind. So, this one, it clearly... Actually, we could do a this if we wanted to. But, remember... Oh, no, we can't do this either. Look at that. It doesn't want to go. It's not the same. Actually, we can do this, though. And then remove this and go one further like this. Like that. Yeah, I think that's good. Anyway, um, but this one is not going to interact. Oh, my God. Look at those rail lines. I think that's an illegal switch. I think this is a very illegal switch. Can we get some consultation from the experts on this? The pros? You know who you know who you are. You know who I'm talking about. Uh, yeah. Matthias is my wonderful partner, and he is a real-life train engineer, and I think he would die after seeing this, maybe. Don't die. Please don't die. Please don't die because I'm showing this. But man, there are so many moving parts in this thing. I can't even say. But it's graphics. It's pixels. I don't think they can do this in real life. Not really. Not like this. Like, you can't make wood do that. Mm -mm. Not a thing. Not a thing. Anyway, but he he, const he consistently provides interesting uh, tidbits about real railroading for us. And I am grateful um, for that advice. Actually, that's kind of how we met. He... Um, he was uh, telling me some stuff about trains uh, in the context of Factorio. And uh, yeah, it was cool. Very cool. So let's see. We want to do... Let's just do this. That seems fine. But yeah, he is such a cool person. Uh, he's a really, really cool person. And he's probably blushing just hearing me say that. But yeah, he is. <laughs> All right, let me do a block here so that as soon as this... I, I, we're not going to have more than one fueling train. What? Who am I kidding? But it's fine. It'll be fine. All right, let's rename this thing and make sure that this is within the network and all connected and all the stuff so that we can get this going. So this is going to be fuel at... This is... Where are we? Red circuits, I think. Um, but yeah. Sorry, I made you blush. <laughs> But he's fabulous. He is so fun. And if you want to hear from him, he's got such a dry wit. Oh, my God. I love his sense of humor. Um, watch our C-Block series. He's really great. And we have a lot of fun. And uh, it's uh, it's a very complicated mod pack, as I love playing. And uh, it's super, super fun as well. So I hope you will enjoy that because um, we do work really hard on it. And it is very brain breaky. But we love giving it to you. We love presenting it for you because it's just, I don't know, pretty great. It's pretty great. Let's refuel the fueling train. I think, I don't know if we've ever done that before. <laughs> Seems like a good idea. Seems like a good idea. So anyway, but um, it's a great series and it is a very complicated mod pack, which it's definitely above beginner level. It's definitely like more intermediate plus kind of thing between intermediate and expert, I would say. Um, it has a slow start, but uh, we're running it at two times speed, so it's fine. And of course, we have a lot of fun. It's hilarious and, and mostly because of him. He He's the real star of the show. Let's be real here. Um, and he's just great. So. Anyway, I hope you enjoy um, that series. Check it out on my channel. 
and we post I post that one every other day so um, it's uh, if you're waiting for something else to complete oh okay uh, plastic train not getting a lot of plastic it looks like there isn't a lot in the boxes but this is moving very slowly because of course red circuits take a while to produce uh, we also are short on copper which is definitely not ideal. Now, remember, all of these factories that I'm doing are to ratio. They are perfect ratio, but if they don't have modules, they don't work at that high level of, uh, of workingness. Yeah. So that's not great. Oh, we have two of those. No, that's not good. Go, go through, do your thing, do your life. Is this one working? Yeah. Show is, it show is. And even though it looks like there's some sidedness here, it all will get consumed. Because you remember the, the inserters will pull from the nearest side of the belt first, but then they will pull from the far side if need be. Um, I think most of these have copper coming in on half and then uh, the other going out. But it is... Oh no! Oh no! Look what we have here. So copper is being... Yeah, it is. It looks like they are putting out on the other half. But this is a proper uh, way of feeding. If you feed it this way, both lanes can jump onto this belt. Sometimes it creates a sidedness thing. But again, this was actually a discussion we had in Discord yesterday. Um, the thing is, is if you use a half a, a one of these, it will only pull from one side of this belt. So you don't want to do that. You want to do this. This is cr proper and correct for keeping and maintaining stuff. And even if we have a sided look to things like these guys if you decide to put balancers at the end of this all you're doing is shifting which machines work and which ones don't work so it doesn't matter it really does not matter and it doesn't matter for productivity doesn't matter for any reason at all anyway um we have red circuits oh my god holy fuzzy cats let's get i think we need to get our blue circuits made um, let's look at the blueprint for that and see where we might put that. Uh, production. Late game. Blue circuits. Yeah, that's the... That's the kind of base blueprint. I want to find the outpost. So this is another one with belts. I like... We're using the belt ones. I feel like it's a good theme today, isn't it? Um, so rem let's remember what we need for blue circuits. We need green circuits, which are over here. We need red circuits, which are over there. And we need sulfuric acid, which is down here. But I think over here is actually a nice spot. It's not bad. Uh, we could put stuff here. These, we'll have to look at the intersections, but they seem okay. Seems to really, uh, this will work, I believe. I think this will work if we do it here. And if we put it like this, no, uh, it doesn't matter where we put it actually, because they're going to come out of this side and, and uh, they need to travel across just to go here, but that's okay too. So none of this, it doesn't really matter. I think it's okay to just have short gaps between stuff like here. I think that's fine. That looks good. They're not going to travel to each other, uh, except they do have a long travel way. They're not going to go like from this entrance up here into the entrance that I'm putting next to it. That is not going to be an issue. Let's see, there's red there. I think this is perfect. Okay, cool. Okay, let's build it. Let's build the thing. Of course, building train first. I was wondering to see if there are any trains that are already pre-made, but there aren't, so that's okay. I would like to get that uh, green circuit train copied, but let's see, do we have... Oh god, why do we have this stuff? Uh-huh, go away. Go away, stuff. Away. I don't need cannon shells. This is not part of my universe. Go the heck away. So what else do we need? Um, let's go over here and fix this stuff. And you. Let's go up and down here. 
try to fill in some of this. Do we... I don't know if it's actually filling anything in, but we can try. Alright, let's have it do the entire outpost here. And I'll take my main Spider-Tron and work on some other stuff and things. Uh, oh yeah, go down here as well. Uh, I want to take the Spider-Tron and look at the intersections and put in signals where we need them. Because this area is way too short to have regular signals. So we want to take out the regular signals so that they don't get caught and have, you know, trains across the road, basically. That's not a good idea. So let's have this one go there. And we'll put in instead a signal like right here. Um, and then this area is going to be just the chain signals. We need the chain signals only in this area where we are. Here, let's just check this out. Just see where the blocks stop. Yep, that's perfect. That is looking good. That will work for us very well. Q seems to be working again, by the way. Uh, we don't care about the double power poles. It do isn't relevant. It just is a little bit of extra power poles. So now this area. All right, this is another one of these, like, let's put some chain signals in here and nothing else. Go away. Okay, this. Get away. Get away way we can do I think we do a chain signal here I don't know if it's needed strictly let's put that there all right and I think that's gonna be good I think we don't really need anything else there and this area is long enough to have multiple trains inside the block blocks because there's more than one block here many blocks so they can easily do stuff oh there's our there's our crawlers look at that our construction crawlers maybe that's what we call the team uh it does look like they're out of stuff so i'm gonna send them back to roo supply and because they ran out of belts here you can see and we did most of this uh part over here so what are you waiting on dude hello oh it's going are you the green circuit one No, you're a plastic. We don't need plastic. We need a green circuit train. I want to copy the green circuit train and... Oh, there it is. Fantastic. Okay, hello. How you doing? Let's stop you for a moment. Because I just want to copy this train. Oh my god, we're missing a car. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yes, we are. Wow, that is interesting. Entities. Trains, not entities, because it has... The thing, there's a couple of other ways we could have copied that as well. But I'm just going to copy the entire train again. You have to shift click this in order to make this work. We'll just put it here. Wait, where's the fueling for this train stop? Is it there-ish? Might be. Okay, you're not getting any fuel. Sad times. Oh no. That's really sad. Oh, there it is. It is. There is. There should be fuel coming in, but there isn't. Okay, we did give it fuel. That's great. Let's go and put in the rest of the cars. Are you serious? We don't have an extra car? No. Okay, it's fine. I'll make two. I'll make two, then we gotta go to resupply, apparently. All right, so now we just change the schedule slightly on this guy. Instead of going to red circuits, we want it to go to blue circuits. I wish you could, like, quick change these. Like, why do we have to delete the stop and add it again? Why can't we just change this destination station? I think Sweet Transit is really good on the train side of things. Uh, it really, really is good. I really like that game. I should start a new playthrough because I really like it. I did this thing where I was doing... Uh, Swedish style uh, play where we have we're driving on the left um, and we named all the uh, the train stops after cities um, uh, near where uh, Matthias drives his route uh, he has a regular route that he drives so that was really cool and kind of fun and he enjoyed that as well okay let's go check these I think did they reach the destination yeah they did okay sometimes I'm like did they get there okay I don't know. Maybe. 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 All right. Here you go over here and just make stuff happen, please. All right. There we are. And this is blue circuits. All right. So 
What else do we need here? We need a red circuit train, which is again, eight cars long. I think that's a bit overkill to be honest for a red circuit train, but, but actually we'll go down, let's go up to, um, go up here because I don't have any more train cars. And we, meanwhile, we'll, we'll watch the, uh, the construction crawlers coming in here. See if they can contribute to the belt situation over here. All right, there we go. And yes, they are working it. Look at that sexy spider trons of work. Mm. Oh yes. And they're catching the bots. That is excellent. Very, very good. I think I might have them carry some other stuff with them like beacons and machines. Let's, let's, let's bring those back up to here where I am. And I will make a red circuit train. So we need to probably go here and get our fish book out again. Not belts. Oh God, come on. When I press escape, I want you to go back one, not close the whole window, you silly thing. All right, rails. But you're like, KOS, you should be used to this by now. Yeah, but it's bad, bad UI design. It's terrible. It is terrible design. It's an. It would be a nice thing if it was just better. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. I should have done it where we actually need it to be. That's silly of me. Okay. Uh, right. Let's go there. And no green. Thank you very much. Add station. Red circuits. Pick up. There are the thingies. Red pickup. I really need to change the name of that station. Okay, so full cargo or 30 seconds. And then add station, blue circuits. Where are they? There they are. Okay, red circuit drop off. Yes. Okay. Uh, empty cargo. Go. Oh. Oh, you need fuel? Of course you do. Silly me silly me okay i was thinking guys can you take some things like maybe we have this one take a whole bunch of stuff well not a whole bunch some stuff apparently let's do like three thousand rails instead of four on this one and then we'll add things like assembling machines let's take 200 of those and then maybe you take pipes or something some, wait, assembling machines and what else? What goes with those? Anything? I don't think so. Not really. Uh, maybe inserters or something. What, we can take like 200 of those. And 200 of these. Okay. Uh, let's look at the next one. Let's take... Instead of 4,000 of these, let's take 3,000 of these. Okay. And then let's take the, maybe some oil machines here, like these guys. Let's take like 50 of these and pipes. We want to take 300 and underflowies, like 300. And then what are the other things that we use? Furnaces? Oh yeah, the other one can have furnaces. This one can have furnaces. And we also need miners. That's a bigger one as well. I don't think oil refineries are needed. I mean, not for this. Uh, let's take 200 of these. Oops, it's not 5,200. That would be too many. 200 of those. And then this one can take miners at like 300 or something. And they may not fill up right away. Um, they might come back time and time again for stuff, but that's okay. I mean, that's just fine. We can, um, we can either expand what we're bringing out from the building train itself. Like here we can take, yeah, we might want to take 300 miners and, uh, 200 furnaces. Maybe that's probably why we're so slow as well. Uh, 200, uh, of those. Yep. That seems good. Good. All right. So. We have now kind of improved our building spider trons a bit as well now. Oh, God, wires are no radar. No radar. 
Gosh, that's weird. Oh, it's because there's no power. Yeah, that would help if we had power. Actual power. Did we ever set up the building train? I don't think so. I don't think we actually did. So that would probably be nice. Um, because we forgot to add the building train here. This is not the belt one. We need to go to this building train. Bit confusing now having two building trains, but it's okay. Okay, oil pickup two is there. So that... It would probably go where? Here, maybe? Blue and then red? Okay, so go right before red circuits. We go to blue circuits. Blue circuits. Building blue circuits. Okay, good. We'll put that above red. Wherever that went. Uh, There? Oh, yeah. There. Yes, there we go. Okay. And time passed. And inactivity. Okay, very nice. Okay, whew. Um, so that's that's a thing that can happen now. Do we do we have radar coverage now? Yes, almost all. Let's fix that one area that does not. It's so annoying when it doesn't like comply with our wishes here. But it is our own fault. I mean we haven't built it, that's why it doesn't work. Oops. So it looks like it's also needing some pumps here. That's a bit of a surprise to me. Do we have pumps in our request list? Oh, we don't. That's interesting. Okay. Well, I hope that the building train will request them. That's kind of needed. That looks very exciting, doesn't it? That's cool. Um pumps. They are with the liquidy stuffs. Yes. Two. They are requesting two. Okay, cool. So now we are going to get some of these and looks like we have one belt out of place. That's okay though. It's just fine. Now we do need to get sulfuric acid. That is another thing we don't have. So I want to grab... Do we have enough liquid cars? Probably not. Oh god, really? Okay, fine. Let's get... Apparently I forgot liquid cars. We need to get, like, let's get eight of them. And we'll build a sulfuric acid... Tra I think that's what we got over here, right? Not just sulfur. Yeah, because it's tanks, right? Okay, it's fine. We go, we go. Let's go back up to train building land. Go to train building land and get this train built. I should ha I should get out the train building depot. That would be ideal. You know what? Let's build it. Let's build the train building depot. Rails, rail, mm, no. Mining, no. No, rail outposts. Oh, here it is, train depot. I knew it was there somewhere. Okay. Let's start, this should be Actually, what we should do is connect this to this, kind of. Or, yeah, because most of the stuff we're going to want built down here. We don't want to build up here. We can always request more train parts. Definitely request more train parts. Okay, there we go. Let's put it here. And we'll build this thing. Oh, let's get that. Well, actually, you know what? I'll show you how this thing works. That's a better use of, of stuff here. These are example cars, um, in case you just want to copy them quick or, or copy paste instead of using the fish book. Depends kind of where you are and what you're doing. So hopefully this is going to be close over there. Let's see. Okay, very good. And we got lights on as well. We, You can't have a depot without lights. Lights are nice everybody see where they're going I guess I can bring the other spider trons up here because there's a lot of uh, track work to be done I'll let them finish the track work there and this these are long enough blocks I don't think we need any special other things here 
So I'm not going to use the building train stop here, I think, because I think it's just close enough to the other one. So I'm just going to take it off completely. Just take it off completely. And they can share the network with this other uh, area, and that's going to be fine. Um, where we can use some, uh, just build the trains from there. We want to make sure that we have enough uh, train parts coming by. I think we ordered a bunch last time. So we want to make sure that that is again, let's do, yeah, six, let's do 10 because the stack size is five. Um, this is, let's make this, let's see, tw six, no, it's four. In, no, it's five in a stack, isn't it? I think it's five in a stack for like train cars. We can change it and add it again. Let's try this. Let's see, for train cars, it is... No, it says one. Oh my god. Let's do a multiple of eight. Let's do have like 32. And these, we definitely need to have a multiple of eight. Let's do 16. We really don't need many, many of those. So yeah, kind of important. But anyway, I'm going to show you how to build a train from the air. And what we're going to do is just put the train down here. You can see we have fueling already set up here. It's really nice. So we're going to build our sulfur train. So let's take this one. And then we need to get the liquid cars. Remember, we're quite far away. So we're just literally plopping it from space here. I think it's four that is needed. It's not really needed to have four. But we have four tanks here, I think. One, two, three, four, or four sets of tanks. So they're going to build this train, hopefully. Folks. This is also, I put some uh, fueling at the end, just in case you have double-headed double, double -headed trains. That can sometimes be needed. But anyway, we'll get this going, and then we are, are going to be able to... In fact, why don't we put down several trains? Uh, I'll put down several locomotives here, and that way we can just start them... We can program them from scratch uh, or right away uh, while the cars are being built. Okay, so for now, though, this is working. This is working very well. Um, it looks like the entire Blue Circuits is built except for modules. As, as we all know, that has been our... <laughs> uh, yes, modules. Anyway, um, now we are going to be able to make some some modules actually we can set up the module outpost somewhere maybe here it might do we can look at let's take our spidertron down here and i'll wait did we get we didn't get it yet no come on you silly thing come on bots it might have to do with the uh i think i overbuilt the solar just a tiny bit you see just a tiny bit not 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 hugely tiny tiny bit yeah, I'm exaggerating. I like doubled the solar. <laughs> so it's not great. It, I mean, it's, it is great, but it's a bit scary because there's a tiny bit too much. And because it looks at every item you put down, it cal like, okay, is this solar panel in storage? Is that solar panel in storage? Is that one? Is that one? Is that one? So it's like going through all of these items, uh, which is decidedly not ideal right now I think we might let's delete some of this actually let's delete this section here let's just delete all this for now uh, oh wait what happened to that I press I pressed okay I pressed the wrong thing go delete okay that's uh, gonna be okay good and it deleted this even though it's still purple. Oh, it's because we're out of radar range, of course. So that's going to lessen uh, the amount of ticks that it requires to go through stuff and things. And I think this might be... Let's see. How big is our module factory? Um, let's see. It's going to be production, late game. I think it's a bot outpost. Yeah, modules. Here it is. So this will fit quite neatly over here, won't it? Now, does this one... Did I need to redo this? I think I need to redo this one. Production, late game. 
bot outposts modules. Yeah, it doesn't have the modules in. So I'm going to redo that between episodes because we're getting to the end of this one. And then we'll kind of put it down here. And uh, yeah, and I'll up update the blueprint book again and all the things. Oh, we're out of plastic. That's not ideal. Why are we out of plastic? It's just slow. It's just slow. We just need modules. But all of this is going to be kind of focused on our module production, especially in the early parts of the game. I don't have any real need for space science. I mean, it's doing robot speed, but it's not really... We don't actually care about this, right? Because our bots are working, and that's fine. Let's get the capacity bonus on the inserters as well. Is there... Yeah, there's worker cargo size as well. So we're going to do those. We're not going to shove any of this stuff into the main base. All we're going to do with this is make more modules. So that should make our trains a little bit happier. Should make the whole base a little bit happier. So, okay, there we go. Plastic is being, again, loaded. How much do we have here? We actually have a... It, it's trickling in, but 4.2K. That's quite a lot between deliveries. That's really impressive, actually. It looks, well, it's being split over eight lanes, so you have to think about that part. But that's a lot, 4,000 plastic. I mean, if we look at, um, let's see, red circuits, for example. Uh, mm -mm -mm, advanced circuits. If we look at this over the past, like, 10 hours, look at this, how much we're doing now. We're doing, like, double of what we were. We were at 911. And we hit, hit a peak here of 2,000, 2.1 K. So that's pretty cool. You know, we are actually making stuff. And then the same with green circuits, which are called, uh, I think they're electronic circuits. No, they're called circuits. What are they called? They're called this. Yeah. Electronic circuits. Yeah. Again. Oh no, that's hello. Go just this. Just this. Um, this is where we were in our base. I'm like maybe here. 485. And now we're making 7.6 thousand. Almost a tenfold increase. So yeah, we're doing really good right now. We are making a lot, a lot of stuff. Remember that the advanced circuits as well as the processing units, basically the red and blue circuits, need a ton of greens. So that's the thing you do first. Um, and, oh, oh dear. Look at this. Oh, that means the energy supply ain't good. Oh, look at the satisfaction. Okay, so we've hit, we've hit the problem here. We can no longer, um, charge the accumulators at night. So that's not good. And the problem is just going to get worse and worse. So we might think about expanding our, no, what's happening? Okay. We have multiple things. I should end the episode before anything else goes wrong. <laughs> so anyway, thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you next time.